Shanty Jet, I hope you're well out there because if you are, thank you because you're making me like, very happy. Anyways, we've got to speak Mandarin some phrases, and that is the foot. The world's number one language book in the whole entire world. Yes. How many people speak it? One About 1.1 1. 1. 1 billion. billion. Wow. That is a lot. That's English is spoken by about 950 million. So like, it's close, but Mandarin slash Chinese is the number one language. There's so many people in China. So guys, I'm going to teach you some Chinese slash Mandarin phrases. Let's get into it. Welcome to Chaz's World with me, Chaz T J I. So guys, as I said, I'm teaching you Chinese slash Mandarin phrases, and the first one is very important in every language. Hello, and that is ni hao, ni hao, ni hao, and ni hao to you. <laughs> so guys, that is how you say hello in Chinese. So guys, the next one we're going to do is Sao Shan Hao. And that is good morning. And um, that's very nice to say to people in Chinese because that good morning is like saying hello sometimes. The next one is Ya Wu Hao. And that is good afternoon in Chinese. Ya Wu Hao, good afternoon. Ya Wu Hao, good afternoon. So the next one is Wan An. That is good night in Chinese. Wan and good night. So the next one is si si, and that is thank you in Chinese. Si si, thank you. Si si, thank you. The next one is di bu qi, and that is sorry in Chinese. Di bu qi, sorry. Di bu qi, sorry. The next one is how da, and that is okay in Chinese. How da. Okay, the next one is mei xie da, that is, it doesn't matter, so mei xie da, it doesn't matter, mei xie da, it doesn't matter. So next one is woman so ba, and you might use it when you're like, get put in your shoes when you're ready to go out the door, and that means, come on, let's go, woman so ba, let's go, woman so ba, let's go. The next one is shi da, and that means yes. Shi da, yes. Shi da, yes. Mi yo is no in Chinese. Mi yo, mi yo, no. The next one is pei hao la, and that is great. Pei hao la, great. Pei hao la, great. The next one is ne yo, and that is, that's not true in Chinese. Nay or that's not true. Nay or that's not true. The next one is qin. That means please in Chinese. Qin. Please. Qin. Please. So when you're at the shops, maybe you want to buy something like a key ring or something like that. So you would say how much in English, but in Chinese you'd say du xiao xian. And that is how much in Chinese. Du xiao xian. How much? Du xiao xian. So if you, when you're at the shop and you see something you like, and you say like, that's good. Good is how in Chinese. Good, good is how. Like if you're saying how much, but just how. So when someone asks you how you feel, sometimes you say like, um, wo gan zhe hen hao, and that is, I feel good. Zhe wo gan zhe hen hao. Wo gan zhe hen hao. So when you welcome someone to your house, you would say welcome, wouldn't you? And that is wan ying in Chinese for welcome. One ying, welcome. One ying, welcome. To tell someone you're welcome is bikuchi in Chinese. That's you're welcome. Bikuchi, you're welcome. Bikuchi, you're welcome. So next one is qingwang yisha, and 
that is please may I ask so if you would if you wanted to ask a question and they were your teacher you might say before please may I ask Ching Wang Yi Sha please may I ask Ching Wang Yi Sha please may I ask so when you want to ask someone when sometime you would say shama sha how and that is when in Chinese shama sha how shama sha how so guys I hope you like my Chinese phrases you can sometimes use these in Chi when you visit China or when you meet China if you have Chinese friends or if you have relatives in China or even it's Chinese New Year this time so you can use it now so you can check in the link in the description for my 130 in Chinese slash Mandarin and like or subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Bye. Check out these other awesome videos by me, Chat TJI. Don't forget to like and subscribe.